The Machida food truck was uh, born out of uh, the desire to explore my cultural identity, uh, to cook food that we were excited to buy, and then at the same time to uh, try and elevate the food truck industry in this area. It took me from the point when I purchased the truck to when it was actually completely finished, eight and a half months. We bought an old Centos truck, gutted it, purchased all of our equipment, installed plumbing, gas lines, electrical uh, wiring, and um, put up stainless steel sheets, and it's all a commercial kitchen inside. When I first started the truck, we didn't know what to expect. I honestly did not know if this would work in this area. First, uh, first day in business, September 10th, we uh, had so much business that we could not keep up. So the first two weeks was really hard in business, and then things started slowing down and getting more into a routine. And after the first year is when we started developing the vision of growing into a restaurant space. We reached the ceiling pretty quick with, uh, with the food truck. We started rubbing our heads on it, and the only way to raise the ceiling was to increase the amount of space and the amount of people we can serve. So we thought that a restaurant would be the best course of action. It's going to be a nice opportunity for us to expand our menu to a whole different style of cooking. But then also a lot of the things that have been very successful as specials will also see a permanent home on the restaurant menu. Pork belly, slow braised brisket, noodle dishes, all sorts of stuff like that. I think it'll be really nice because we're going to have more menu options, we'll have more choices, get to try more things. I mean, he likes to be creative and I think it will give him a venue to do that. Oh, oh I can't wait. <laughs> I think it's going to be... Uh, yeah, sometimes the food truck is gone, which is our saddest time. Um, it makes us sad, so it'll be we'll be able to go whenever we feel like it to the restaurant. So we're really excited about that too. Being able to serve individuals our food and seeing them smile and bringing people together is the real reason why we open this, and uh, also the reason why I get up every morning. The new restaurant is planned to open this summer at 105 North Liberty Street. Reporting Harrisonburg, Virginia, I'm Grace James.